This is an example of using cross product to calculate torque. This problem is from Giancoli, Chapter 11, Problem 27. You start by writing out the equation for torque. Torque is the cross product of R cross F. R is the point of application of the force. F is the force vector. You express both in the I, J, K component form. Don't forget the units. You set up the cross product 3 by 3 matrix with the unit vectors as the first row. The second row must be the components of R. The last row must be the components of the force. You take the determinant of the matrix. In this example, we are using the downhill uphill mnemonic method. You make the multiplications and collect the terms. Finally, to interpret the results, you use the right hand rule. Does the force as applied at the point R have a tendency to twist our object around each axis according to the torque components. To check, raise the thumb of your right hand. Point it in the direction of the axis. Then curl your fingers around that thumb which will give you the tendency of the rotation. Notice that in this example, the right hand rule shows the tendency of rotation around the positive x axis, positive y axis, and negative z-axis.